The Elden card is used for blood grouping with the ABO and Rhesus systems. An Elden card has a section with four circles. The first circle contains anti-A, the second anti-B, and the third anti-D. The fourth circle is a control circle. Solutions of monoclonal antibodies have been applied onto the anti-A, the anti-B, and the anti-D circles. Tear open the aluminium envelope or cut open the resealable aluminium bag. Take out an Elden card. Collect some water using the pipette. Put one drop of water onto the coloured area inside each circle. A capillary blood sample can be taken from either a fingertip or an earlobe. Wipe the fingertip clean with the sterile wipe. Pierce the skin with the lancet. Using your thumb and forefinger, gently squeeze just above the puncture site and press out a drop of blood. Squeeze one drop of blood onto each of the four teeth. To collect the optimal volume of blood, the diameter of the droplets should be the same diameter as the teeth. An automatic lancet can also be used. Here, four Elden sticks are used instead of the Elden comb. Dip the four drops of blood into the four drops of water that have already been put onto the Elden card. Make sure that each tooth of the Elden comb stays within its own circle and that the teeth remain pressed against the card. Stir the blood until the reagents have dissolved and smear the blood out to the edge of each circle. Now, tilt the Elden card into a vertical position and wait 10 seconds. Then, turn it upside down and wait another 10 seconds. Tilt the card to one side and wait 10 seconds. Then finally, tilt the card in the opposite direction and wait another 10 seconds. Place the Elden card onto the table. Look for any agglutinations and note down the blood group of the patient. Leave the card to dry. The drying process can be speeded up by using a hairdryer. When the card is dry, cover the circles with the adhesive plastic film. This protects the results of the blood grouping and contains any infectious matter that might be present in the patient's blood. The adhesive plastic film can be used to attach the Elden card to the patient's records. The alternative to using the Elden comb is to use four Elden Sticks. Elden Sticks can be used on any type of Elden card. In particular, the double and triple Elden cards, where the comb is not suitable. Make sure to use a separate Elden Stick for each circle on the card. Add the blood to the water and leave the stick in the circle. 
Press the stick in the anti-A circle firmly against the card, and stir the blood until the reagent has dissolved, making sure to smear the blood out to the edge of the circle. Discard the Eldon stick, and repeat the procedure with the other three circles.